It doesn't cut. Like, that's the easy part. Mm -hmm. Wow, what's that? Uh, I don't know what to call it yet. <laughs> nice. So, yeah, it'll whatever, be a new way of whatever beats you kind of just The beats are, uh, the, uh -huh. the speaker's got a, a pin attached to it with a, right, right, a, a right. flat head on the bottom, and it tra basically transfers the waves into the water. And the, right now it's just two heads, right? So I'm just reading yeah, yeah, random yeah. points of the waves. And the waves right. bring it up and it conducts, and then it comes down and it breaks right. the connection. So it's going through the water and then... And then to the solid state relays and pull the two in front of lights. Mm -hmm. But uh, the cool thing is, I think one, if I do a nice one with just a bunch of flat pins like a screen, uh -huh. I can actually see the wave on the lights, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because the, and water waves are so slow that you can see them with your eye, unlike like sound or light or whatever. Nice. I don't have That's to slow cool. it down. So once I get like, if I put a line of pins, uh -huh. the, the, they should yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you kind of like visualize the, the, the sound. waves and yeah. the sound. You can see the sound. Even just alone, and these are crappy, they don't have waves, these are just on off. So you can get better ones that will actually make the wave. Mm -hmm. The on off ones can create this hypnotic, like. And it's a once time, like it's, there's no repeat, there's no pattern. It just, every time you play it, it's different. The only downside is running electricity through water grows almost every metal in the world. It's for like titanium and stuff. So. Uh, it costs copper to run this. It eats copper. 